In this video, we're going to look at a method that allows you to select an HTML element by using CSS selectors. The document query selector method returns the first element within the document that matches the specified selector. So for example, if you wanted to return the first element with a particular class name, you give the query selector a string with a dot followed by the name, just like we do in a CSS file. If you wanted to return the element with a particular ID, you use a pound sign followed by the ID value. You can also just specify a tag name. So if you wanted to return the first div tag, you just specify div. In our JavaScript code, we're specifying a class, so its name is preceded by a dot. We have three div tags with the same class name, so only the first one will be returned. In this example, we have HTML code for a page with three articles. When the button is clicked, the first article will be highlighted. So let's look at how this works. When the button is clicked, the highlight item function is called. Then the query selector method will find the first element with a class that's named article. The results will be put into this variable. Then the variable is used to change the background of the element. Let's try it out. And that's how you use the document query selector method in JavaScript. I hope you found it helpful. Thanks for watching and please subscribe and leave a comment.